So here I am at my spiritual home once again. It's not quite New England, but Tandalos is looking very colourful this autumn. Back soon. One of the fantastic things about autumn, even though the leaves are dying down, you can always find some catkins that makes you think that spring's not far away. Just wonderful. You can see that this is the rural, rural urban fringe. This is Oldham in the distance with its civic centre. And just peeping up in the background there's West Yorkshire, the dark side. And vaguely in the distance is Manchester city centre bit difficult to see today. It's only about two o'clock in the afternoon and you can see the sun's starting to go down and the city skyscape, skyscrape, skyscape is getting red. So now you might be able to see the hills of West Yorkshire as the top of the Pennines and this is in the distance Saddleworth and you can see that we've still got a little bit of green space left around here it keeps getting encroached on and you might be able to make out some of the cotton mills cotton spinning mills they've not spun cotton for many a long year those are just a couple of what were hundreds within my lifetime. Okay, this is part of the wooded part of um, Tandalos. You can see there's quite a lot of beech trees here, all planted in the mid 19th century to stop radicals plotting and drilling against the government of that time. If you know Alan Partridge, you'll know that he did his um, cross-country running round here. It's actually Steve Coogan that did his cross-country running as a lad round here. Right, I've got to the top, nearly to the top of one of the hills in Tandalos. Um, a bit out of breath, so I'm, I'm having to sit down. I'm not a sporty person, although I do cycle, and when I get the feeling, I go swimming. But I've never been a sporty. So I had perhaps an average level of fitness. But I think that having that level has helped me to get back um, to be able to get about much more easily than if I'd um, had a very sedentary life and that's not to say I'm not a couch potato quite a lot of the time um, so I'm really happy I've got this far today